Hey guys, how's it going? So today, what I have in front of me is another Airsoft Global package. So today I'm going to be doing an unboxing video for you. We're going to just keep it short and sweet and get right into it. So, got my uh, knife here, so let's do it. Now, one thing to notice, real quick before I open this, the delivery literally was lightning fast and I chose the two to four week option. So it literally came to Illinois in about six days which to me is a just lightning record fast delivery time from these guys so definitely was very very surprised with that um, just thought i'd mention that i don't know why it was so so quick but i'm not complaining in the slightest here so again you can see we they have that like weird scotch tape paper packaging um that's unique to Airsoft Global's just packaging system. I'm not sure why, but it works. I guess they ca it came through just fine. So let's get some of this green paper off. Now I got looks like one box and there's two. So just take this paper off completely. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see which one's first. We'll do this one first. Why not? So, looks like plain old box, nothing, no markings, nothing unique really. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what we got in here. Ah, so you can tell that that is the G35. So this one is definitely a first for my collection. If you guys have been kind of keeping up to date with my collection with the Wii G pistols, this is a new member right here. So here we got the magazine which is the same size as the G17, G18C magazine. And then of course, the pistol itself and this clear packaging. So let's take that out. Ooh, wow, look at that. That is awesome. So you can see there's a huge thing of uh, electrical tape right across there. Um, and then the made in Taiwan. And hmm, surprisingly, it didn't cover anything here. Typically they would. And then of course you have the orange tip there that's like really flimsy, which is really like super easy to take out. This is the G35, so this is the semi and full auto edition. Um, so you have the ported barrel for this. I think the G34 also is ported. Um, but man, that is epic. Look at that thing right there. So yeah, look at that. Also the electrical tape pretty much covers the whole thing. And here's the, the box that they flipped inside out again for US customers they will do this um, mainly for like a customs thing to avoid getting um, anything confiscated so man that is a beauty right there look at that a new feature to my collection something that I've been waiting to add for a good while and I figured now's the time so definitely be on the lookout for some shooting demos for full-on reviews and some uh, slow motion on that bad boy as well with that full auto. So that's the G35. Let's go ahead and check out what the other box is. So we'll put we'll put that over there for right now. Now this one it's a little bit bigger. You can see it's thicker. So what could it be? Let's take a look. This one. Ah, whoa! That is a really cool. Let me kind of show you. That packaging looks really epic. Now, as you guys can see based off of that image, it's exactly what you're seeing. The double barrel Glock. Look at this freaking monster magazine. Oh my goodness, this is insane. This weighs like, whew, that's like a dumbbell or something. And then this thing, oh my god. Oh, holy crap, guys. This is a freaking monster. Look at that. I've never seen anything like this before. Unreal. Everything is just like fused together. And then just one sight. Oh, wow. And as you can tell, this is the full auto edition. This is the G18C double barrel. Oh, my goodness. You, you really need to have a big freaking hand for this thing because... 
I mean, I'm I'm pretty much barely getting it there. But dang, look at this thing. Holy crap. So it looks like a Gen 3 lower frame as well. And then this one, it actually has no uh, specific trademarks to it, which I just noticed, which is interesting. But now that magazine... Oh, this is literally like two Glock. Two Glocks in my hand, it literally is. Oh my goodness, that is freaking epic. Obviously no holster could fit this dang thing. Oh wow, let's see. Let's take a look at the box. I've never seen this type of a box before. So, looks like there's the manual in here. And then let me flip it for you. This is what it looks like, the uh, double barrel series for the G pistols. And you can see they have all these options available for the uh, double barrel, which is pretty cool. Um, I would like to see the G26 actually for that. That would be even more epic. And then the, uh, the little red holder here. But yeah, guys, I mean, this was the epic Glock unboxing for today. Two huge and beastly members to the Glock family for my collection. Um, I'm definitely eager as hell to do some reviews for you guys on these things. So, you know, definitely stay tuned. You will be seeing some uh, videos coming your way with these probably in the next week or two or so. But anyway, that's everything I had for you guys today. This was the uh, Airsoft Global Unboxing. As you can see, it made it through just fine without any issues with customs. Um, and I'm really happy, so I'm just going to go ahead and get into just playing around with these a little bit. And you guys have a good day.